What did you think of that footage I just showed you on third phase of the movie? We need more of that. Yeah, a lot more. I was, I was impressed. Yeah. If you got one message out there for all the YouTube viewers, third phase of the moon, what would you have to say? About this, um... About this and about UFOs in general. Oh, I think they exist. And um, the thing issue is, you know, there's not a lot of, like, footage I think that people can rely on. And, you know, unless it's in front of their face, maybe they don't believe that it's happening. So, but maybe once it starts happening more, then it'll be more prevalent and, you know, more believable. Right, thank you. Right. We are live with Bill at the 2013 uh, Super Soldier I Summit. Are you having a good time? Oh, this is awesome, yeah. All right. What do you think of the footage I just showed you on Third Phase of the Moon? Um, all right, that was really cool because, as we discussed, um, when you watch the glowing ball, it's moving. You could, you could see the wing moving, of course. The person is moving a little because he's in a plane. And the ball is not moving because of the camera guy's move, motion. Or, you know, you can, if you match it to the wing, you'll see that the wing of the plane is, is not moving with the ball. So it's not like the ball is stationary and it's only moving uh, relative to because of the camera guy shaking. It's not. It's not. It's, it's changing position. What'd you think of the UFO footage I just showed you? Absolutely scary. <laughs> if you got one message for all the YouTube viewers, Third phase of moon, what would you have to say to everybody? What would I have to say? I would say be aware, don't be afraid, and always learn. That's right. What What do you think of the footage I just showed you on Third Phase of Moon? Yeah, yes, I thought that was real, and and I, uh, because uh, of what the guy says, you have the frame of reference of that wing, that which is steady, and this thing whirling around. So it wasn't a trick of the camera. So I, I totally agree. It's, it's very credible. Alright, we are live at the Super Soldier Summit 2013. Hi. You having a good time? Yeah, it's awesome. Alright, what did you think of the footage I just showed you up there, Phase Moon? Very cool. Good job to the whoever recorded it for catching it in time. Anything you want to say to the YouTube viewers, one message to all the viewers third phase moon. Keep your eyes on the skies. That's right, thank you. <laughs> yeah. You're bigger. What do you think of the footage I just showed you on third phase of moon? I think it's awesome. Uh, we need to get more of that out there. That's that's pretty legitimate. That's quick. What do you think about the other videos on third phase of moon? Um, I'm pretty happy with what you guys have been putting out, so I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep watching it. If you got one message for all the YouTube viewers and third phase of moon, what would you say? Um don't stop believing. I know that sounds kind of cheesy, but you know, question everything and look into everything and don't stop yourself from believing in something. What did you think of that uh, video I just showed you on Third Phase of Moon? I haven't had a chance to validate it. I simply look at video and take a scientific approach. It's not a, a feeling of what I think it is or not. I, I, I live in a hundred percent world. It means nothing to me what I what it, it looks good. Star Wars looks good, mm -hmm. but uh, so did Japan's. Um, space shuttle when they pulled it out of its hangar. It looked real, but it was a styrofoam cup. Yeah. I hit it with a biophoton analyzer was able to determine what it was made of. So that's what I do with UFOs. Uh, also their neural signature, um, it, uh, it, uh, it's like a fingerprint on the outside of the ship. We can actually tell who the occupants are. I've been doing that for about a decade. Yeah, I'm having a good time. The video I've just seen with the object would need to be carefully analyzed because it could be a reflection of something in the cabin and it's too brief. Yeah, So one has to be very careful about this. And I find the only way to actually get video through the aircraft is to completely cover your head so mm -hmm. there's absolutely nothing between you and your eyes or the camera. And maybe if the camera was right up against the window, possibly. And, um, it's good. You've got to just check it out. Hey, we love to have every view. If you got one message out there for all the viewers, Third Phase of Moon, what would you have to say? Keep videoing, keep keep shooting video. It's a good video because it's got relativity about it. In mm. other words, you've got a wing as a distance reference and it's, there's stuff like that. Yeah. And don't use digital zoom. And keep it in focus and make sure you're focused on the object far away and not, not focused on something closer. That's excellent. Now, if uh, the footage I just showed you on Third Phase of Moon, what do you think of it? Uh, it looks looks pretty realistic. I've seen stuff like that, oh, you know, already. I've, I've done some film like that, and uh, yeah, I mean, you know, I'm not going to say the, where I think it comes from or who's flying it, but it certainly looks pretty realistic. Excellent. You know, 
Uh, if you got one final message to all the viewers, Third Phase of the Moon, what would you have to say to everybody? Third Phase of the Moon. The world's largest UFO YouTube channel. I say tune in and send in your videos and don't be afraid of people ridiculing you and thinking that you're nuts because uh, there's more of us now than there are of them. So, hey, that's be, right. Have no fear. Can you tell all the viewers what a super soldier is? And why this is so important and people know briefly. A super soldier is um, the next step in human evolution. No, a cyborg, essentially. So just the two merged together, a technology and human. Exactly, yeah. They're having, um, their bones are being enhanced with metal for starters, but it's more complex than that. All right, on. All right, that footage I just showed you on Third Phase of the Moon, you know, that airplane footage from Qatar, what would you have to say about that? What do you think about it? Uh, I thought it was interesting footage. I'd like to see more of it. All right. If you got one message for all the YouTube viewers, Third Phase of the Moon, what would you have to say to everybody? I'd just say keep an open mind and look into these areas. Ladies and gentlemen, it's your surely arriving into Dubai. Now I'll ask you to please return to your seats. Make sure your hand luggage is placed underneath the seat in front of you. On the overhead lockers, and then you see back to some right with both arm rest down. Window blinds should be open. Tray tables and footrest should be folded and stowed, and you see belt securely fastened. To ensure you're fully aware of the exit nearest to you and the safety feature on the safe road, please read the safety risk in your seat pocket. 